nurses, yeah? You could either be a governess, which is a bit like being a nanny or an au pair, uh, but you didn't have much freedom, yeah? You, you could, of course, marry someone, which is what most women did, yes? Uh, there were other choices too, but we'll touch that. And then you could, you could be a teacher. So, for example, this young lady, Sarah Now, she started her own school. So this is quite a wealthy area to live here. And even here uh, today, you know, Oxfordshire is one of the wealthiest parts of the UK. They are not, they're not believing oh, the children. They don't believe it. No? Well, Oxford City, yeah. yeah. Oh, I see, right. So, um, when we had the European referendum, the places that voted to stay in Europe were either very wealthy areas, because they think things are working widely, or they were areas that are like Scotland, that uh, have different political views, yeah? The places that voted to leave Europe, these are the towns that got left behind, yeah? Where there's not enough jobs, there's poverty. And my view is that they are right to be angry, but I don't understand why they're angry with you. They should be angry with their own government. Yeah. So, uh,